Hey Aries, welcome to your WLC Weekly Love Connection reading. So this reading will be for those of you who are wanting to get insights with regards to your love connections. To all my subscribers, thank you for stopping by once again. If you need information about my readings, personal readings, um, as well as um, extended reads, they are all in the description box below. I hope everybody is staying well, especially about the, around this time. All right, this is for Aries. Let's go ahead and see what do we have for you in love. This is for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and Jupiter. In love, you have the Emperor, the Page of Cups, the um, Eight of Swords, the Five of Coins, the Ten of Wands, You have the Two of Swords, um, Justice, and the Lovers. Mm -hmm. You have the Palace of Cups and the King of Wands. Got you one more. Wow, the Chariot, beautiful. At the bottom of the deck, we have the Hierophant. So, Aries, this could be, um, you could be in, in a marriage right now. I mean, this could talk about a, co a commitment, uh, a commitment with a solid foundation or, you know, just some sort of, um, could be married to one another, being in a, you could be in a long-term relationship with one another. But I do see here that as of the moment, there seemed to be a, a desire for both of you to um, probably even just step back a bit. There seemed to be um, the underlying energy I see is that there is that wanting to fix what has been broken here. But at the same time, there seems to be a, um, an element of control that is currently boiling in this in this connection primarily because um i feel that somebody has wronged someone here in this connection and on your side aries i do see that um you're wanting to start um possibly reaching to reach out to your person to um talk things out, this could be you wanting to extend an apology, but at the same time, at the same time, I could see that you are not able to make any moves for now. You're up in your head thinking what's the best way to do, what, how, how to deal with this connection. It's pretty quiet right here, I feel. Someone here, I feel it is strongly you, Aries, that you're wanting to at least get uh, a sort of resolution for this connection. If you have been fighting, this is you now wanting to just, you know, be able to sit in one room and talk things out without argumentation, uh, argument, arguments. Mm-hmm. without arguments and um, you're wanting to have possibly an opportunity to talk to your person about that about um, discussing the cause of the root cause of this issue of what you both have encountered or are undergoing right now And I also feel that you're beginning to see um, or realize, you know, there's some sort of awakening of what's the right thing to do, quote unquote, what's the right thing to do here. And I do feel that it's actually on you. I feel you're wanting to, you're the one here who is more action oriented. You're wanting to reach out. You see things as um, clearly as it is right now. For the moment, I see that 
you're letting things be, um, possibly waiting for the dust to settle. Uh, mm -hmm. But this is a connection, Aries, that is pretty much difficult for you to let go. So you're not letting go. I do see that. You're actually planning um, to start things off here. It's just a matter of how to oil the engine to get things started. Mm -hmm. And you want to be able to make things right here with this person. For for If you have um, wronged this person in the past, I do see you um, reconnecting and making things right. You miss this person. You want to be back um, with this person for, you know, a romantic connection, romantic love. Being with one another romantically. And there's just this pause here, I feel. With regards to your person, um, this is someone who may be having some financial issues right now, given the circumstances that we're in. Um... They could be doing more jobs than they should in order to survive. I feel there's some sort of responsibility that they are um, taking care of right now. And it's uh, pretty much a burden for them. Um, with regards to this connection, this person is also burdened not being able to talk to you, not being able to be with you or to communicate with you the usual way you both know how, yeah? But I do see, Aries, it's you here. I do see this energy right here. You're wanting to make this right. It seems like there's been an understanding that you have um, garnered that um, I do feel that you are, you're, you're, you're feeling as though this is the connection that you wanted all along. You have realized that. You have wanted and you have needed all along. There is deep connection here. There's, there is love. Um, it's just a matter of um, getting back into each other's energy space. And I do see you doing just that. You're not going to stop yourself. And I feel that you're, you're going to be making a decision here. Yeah, based on your on how you feel, and how you feel is you still want this, you still want to proceed and um, you know make a decision to take control. There's an element of control here, element of control and making a decision to move things forward. Yeah, with regards to your person, there's some sort of them feeling lack of something, or. This could also be somebody who needs financial help. This could also be somebody who um, a little bit insecure of where they're at right now. As, um, you know, or are they um, capable enough or, so to speak, suitable enough to be, to be your partner or something like that. So um energies could go vice versa or um reversed so take it however that resonates with you but i do see that you are making this significant moves in in this connection um and you're wanting this aries i do even see that you want to express how you feel what you want um to do or to how to bring this connection forward things like that. You want a new start here. You want to be able to to touch base with this person, talk things out, what's going on with them, especially in this around this time where things are locked down. But your person seems to be not in a very um, good place. They try to control whatever they can control, and I feel that it's more rather on survival or them being able to uh, work through their responsibilities. Mm -hmm. but this is someone who is also burdened and feeling left out in the cold for not being with you and um, I'll be extending this reading and I will be um, if this resonates with you you can follow me in the extended the link is in the description box below I'll be um, 
uh, delving more on your person's energies and see how they feel about this connection, any advice we can get to navigate um, in this situation, as well as um, any um, direct messages that they want to um, impart to you. So the link is in the description box below. Otherwise, leave me comments and let me know how this resonates with you. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe and click on the notification bell. If this is where we part ways, thank you for stopping by.